So Daphne for Sutton, celebrity, I've um, taken a little break from her content because I don't want to mud it, you feel me? I don't want to mud shit, you feel me? But um, we're we going to check this out right here. Um, let's see what's going on in this situation. So, so this person right here says, good morning, beautiful. And it says, hey, Zay, good morning. So what you got planned for later? Nothing, I'm off at 415 and home by 5. So bet, okay, okay, bet. I got his reservations at a new restaurant that opened by me. I figured that would be a good first date. We only got one hour time slot because it's the opening and they'll be packed. You have to be on time, boo. So 6.55 p.m. will be perfect because the reservations is for seven. That sounds amazing. I can be there at 6.45 p.m. to be safe. Just send an address, sweetheart. I'm excited. Okay, cool. It's only 19 minutes from my house. I got you, boo. Okay, so he, they're going on a date and um, she's gonna meet him there. So, all right, bet. But time is very important because they only have a one hour time slot. So let's pay attention to that. So later that night, oh God, later that night. <laughs> so right, um, he says, hey, what's the deal? It's 647, you close? He says, hello. She says, sorry, leaving my house now. He said, what? <laughs> I told you our reservations were at seven. We only have an hour slots. You said it takes 20 minutes from your crib. You will be late as hell. She says, I'm already on the freeway is what I meant. I'm almost there. Relax, boo. He says, um, damn, it's 706. Where the fuck are you, Kara? You ain't picking up the phone. What's the deal? You here? He says, about to pull in. You about to pull in at 707. I'm here at 726. Where are you, Zay? Zay. He says, you told me at 707 you were pulling in. I waited five minutes and left. You are now texting me at 726 to tell me you're here. So it took you 19 minutes to pull in. I'm good, love. Enjoy. That means when she says I'm about to pull in, that means she was just leaving the crib. She was just leaving the house or whatever. I don't know. Damn. So she says, what? You left? Are you fucking serious, Zay? You should have told me you left. That's an asshole move. I drove all the way out here shaking my head. I'm done with you. He says, I specifically told you when to be here. I was nice enough to stay five minutes after you said you pulled in. You wasted my time, so you telling me you're done is hilarious. I was done when I left. Good day. She says, bitch ass nigga vibes. But okay. He says, left in the dust vibes. <laughs> Damn. So, um, so Daphne says he told her when to be at the restaurant. She was 26 minutes late. Being late comes with consequences. He did the right thing. I would have too. What are y'all thoughts? Was he wrong? I'm going to tell you nah, bro. She could have been honest. If she would have been honest and says, I'm sorry, I'm running super late then he would have been able to say, all right, okay, I got it, I got it. We're gonna miss this place and I will go ahead and just find somewhere else. But at least he told her, but she lied to him and would have had that man waiting for about uh, 30 minutes. Cause he says, she says 6.55, that's what, that's, he told her 6.55. She told him 6.45. <laughs> so he like, okay. <laughs> You told me an earlier time, thinking you really trying to be on it, but you end up coming 26 minutes late, over a half hour after the time that you told me to come, that you switched it for the meetup. And then you lied about it, saying that you were pulling in and still came 20 minutes after you told me that you were pulling in. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, listen, you got to check shit like, because it's going to happen over and over and over again. And if this is a guy that's very, very punctual, and he's seeing this right here, bro, I understand if you don't want to deal with that. I get it if you don't want to deal with that. That's your prerogative. Because these little arguments right here could lead to something big, and it could lead to a relationship full of issues and little petty shit and not being respected. But I don't know. Do y'all think he was wrong? Me? I don't think he was wrong at all. Could he have told her that, you know, he left? Yeah, he could have told her, but she could have told the truth too and said that um, she was running late, you know? It is what it is. She wasted some makeup, probably. <laughs> and um, I hope he ain't waste no money because sometimes you got to book for some reservations, but probably not. Probably not. But once again, what y'all think about this in the comment section below? I'm going to get the fuck up out of here, though. It's your boy this, and I fuck with you. And the reason why, because you, you fucks with me. Yay, my.